Hello and welcome to Language Ladder. We are back with another very useful video for you. How many of you go blank on entering a restaurant and don't know what to say first, especially in a fine dining restaurant? And then you start thinking about the right expression, right words, and there is this awkward silence or pause. So in today's video, you're going to learn all the basic sentences you need to know about ordering food in a restaurant. So without any further ado, let's get started. Hello ma'am, how can I help you? We'd like a table for two please, thank you. Sure, this way please. Mm, this looks a little noisy. Can we have a quiet table, a little away from the door please? Certainly. Please give me a moment. Of course. This way, please. Thank you. Now let's look at some useful expressions that we can learn from this conversation. Expression number one. We would like a table for two, please. We'd like a table for two, please. You can say this on entering a restaurant to book or reserve a table for yourself. You can also say, could you find us a table for four? So you may change the number depending on the number of people with you. So we would like a table for two, please. Could you find us a table for two? Expression number two. Can we have a quiet table, please? Or you may say, can we have a table by the window? Or can we have the table away from the door or away from the toilet, please? Depending on where you want to sit. Can I have the menu, please? Certainly. Can I take your order? Give us a moment. We'll let you know soon. Okay, ma'am. Are you ready to order? Yes, please. For starters, we'd like to have some honey chili potatoes. Can I get you something to drink? Yes. One fresh lime soda, please with very little sugar and a dash of salt. Sure, ma'am. For mains, can we get Hakka noodles with vegetables in black bean sauce? Certainly, ma'am. Please bring the main course a little later. Definitely, ma'am. I'll go and get the starters and your drink first. That would be great. Thanks. Now let's look at some useful expressions that we can learn from this conversation. Expression number one. Can I have the menu, please? So you ask for a menu to look at the food that is served at the restaurant. Can I have the menu, please? You may also ask, what's the chef's specialty? Or which dish would you recommend? Or you could even say, could you suggest a dish which is not too spicy or not too sweet, depending on what you like eating? Expression number two. Give us a moment, please. We'll let you know soon. So we say this when we want to take some time to decide what we want to order. Give us a moment, please. Expression number three. For starters, we'd like to have, and you name the food items. Or you may even say, we'd like to start with, and you name the food items. Expression number four. One fresh lime soda with very little sugar and a dash of salt, please. So it's a good idea to explain how you want your food or drink to taste. So you can mention if you want something to be less sweet or less spicy or salty. Expression number five. For mains, can we have, or you can say, for the main course we'd like to order and you name the food items. Expression number six. Please bring the main course a little later. So again, it's a great idea to specify the gap that you want to have between your starters and your main course. Please bring the main course a little later. Excuse me, I placed my order half an hour ago. We haven't got our food as yet. I'm really sorry for the delay. I'll quickly go and check. Your order is on its way, ma'am. It won't take long. Great, thank you. Let's look at some helpful expressions that we can pick up from this conversation. Expression one. Excuse me, 
I placed my order a while ago. We haven't got our food as yet. So you can say this if there is a delay in your order or if you want to gently remind them to bring your food. Expression number two. It won't take long. It won't take long. A very helpful expression that any of us can use whenever we want to say, please wait. It won't take long. How was the food, ma'am? It was lovely. We thoroughly enjoyed it. Would you like something for dessert? No, thanks. We are good. Can we have the bill, please? Sure. Now, let's look at what we can learn from this conversation. Expression number one. It was lovely. We thoroughly enjoyed this. So, you can say this to give compliment to the food or to the chef. You can even add, please pass our compliments to the chef. Expression number two. No, thanks. We're good. So you may say this when you do not want to order anything else. No thanks, we're good. Expression number three. Can we have the bill please? Can we have the bill please? Notice that when you start a sentence with the word can, it sounds like can. Can we have the bill please? Now this is the last step after you have finished eating. You ask for a bill. Can we have the bill please? An alternative to this would be Check please. Check please. So next time when you visit a restaurant, remember these expressions and try using them. Hope you found this video useful. If you are new here, then consider subscribing to our channel and don't forget to press the bell icon next to it so that you do not miss any of our latest videos. And don't go away without hitting the like button. So that's all for now. See you again.